I want to come up with a different way of powering up my Canon system. And I'm going to do it using this. My Canon system uses an LPE8. Um, it's 7.2 volts uh, at 1.1 amps. I uh, actually use it in a BGE8 uh, grip that holds two batteries in it. So it gives me some longer life. When you get the BGE8 grip, it comes also with this as a backup. You load it up with a bunch of double A's and uh, you can use it uh, to uh, continue recording for a little while. But I don't really use this. It's been in my camera bag forever. So I'm going to modify it so I can use this bank. This is a LiPo power bank. Um, I got this off Amazon. And I actually use it to uh, power up my uh, Tascam field recording system and it lasts a really long time. I gotta figure out polarity. That's easy enough. These are the two connections uh, that connect up to the camera. And as you can see, we're getting 9.7 volts. So positive is on the bottom. The other thing we gotta figure out is where to wire everything up. Okay, so let's change over to continuity here. All right, let's figure out where the wires, where all these connections go. And let's first try our nearest neighbor. So there's positive. I'm trying to find negative now. Yep, there it is. So if you're wondering um, how am I actually going to connect this up, I have this. This is a, a USB cord, uh, as you can see. So I can focus there. There we go. Um, I don't remember where this came from, but I, but whenever I have a device that goes bad or the wiring gets frayed, I cut these off. Because uh, these make great 5 volt power cords, and uh, the USB specification uh, is data is in the two. I don't know if you can focus that is on the two um, connections in the middle, and uh, voltage and ground are on the outside. You just need to figure out which one is which. Now to get the wire through, I'm going to have to drill a hole. Somewhere around here, I guess. Um, just got to make sure I don't mess with the locking lever here. Yep. That worked out pretty good. Before doing anything else, I need to bring the voltage down to 7.2 volts. Bingo. And there it is. I went ahead and soldered the positive and the negative connections. And underneath, I uh, just put some some of that foamy double stick in like three different layers just so that uh, it wouldn't go anywhere and it is it, it's on there man let's uh, plug it in bingo 
All we got to do is remove the battery pack. Put in our new DC to DC step up voltage. Plug it in and turn the camera power on. Thank you.